Good enough. Thank you. Like <laughs> and subscribe. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Today I'm going to do a kind of a simple uh, install, but it's something that uh, if you have a mobile home, uh, if you know anything about the mobile home doors, they're thinner, uh, the door set, the lock sets are completely different than a regular standard home lock set. Um, I searched all over the internet, all over YouTube, trying to find a fix for you didn't have to buy just straight mobile home door sets. Uh, so basically. Uh, there is a trick to it, and I was going to share that with you guys. But anybody lives in a mobile home and, and you and you have to change the doorknobs on like the bedrooms, the closets, or anything like that. It's a pretty simple fix, uh, and with a standard uh, bed, bed and bath uh, set. It's a quick set. Maybe a quick set. I've already tore the package open, but uh, this is bed and bath, and these are for standard size doors, not mobile home doors. Okay, with that being said, I've already tore it open, like I said. That's the lock set, you know, standard lock. Okay, the trick to these things are right here. Uh, these things here. Okay, when you buy this, this is the the set, The I don't know exactly what it's called, but this is what goes inside the door. You know, it's uh, what latches the door, the, the assembly here. All right. The trick to it is, take and pry this apart all right take this off slide this one off okay now you have a standard mobile home door type deal here all right um, these things are like 12 13 dollars for the cheap ones uh, basically that's all you need um, it comes with everything even the new striker screws, everything like that. So, like I said, the reason I'm doing this video is because I actually searched the internet for quite some time trying to find a cheap fix to these doors, change the doorknobs on them to where they are reliable. These old mobile home doors, you know, they got the little, you poke a hole in it, you poke in there to unlock the door, uh, and they, they're just cheap, they'll come apart. And ours actually got us locked in the bathroom, so I took it completely out. and. Uh, Anyway, that's what we come up with, and I'm gonna go install it right now and show you guys how how it's installed in a mobile home door. All right, uh, but before I do that, if you haven't done so yet, uh, please hit that, uh, that like and subscribe button. Uh, it's free, don't cost you anything. Uh, I come up with all these little, little hacks and stuff all the time. Uh, I'm all the time working on something, so. Um, anyway, we'll get in there and uh, I'll show you how it's installed, and uh, be right back. Alrighty, guys. I got all my stuff here. Um, but like I said, the key to it is popping this piece off. You can also, if you wanted to, you could like, you know, cut out the recess part for this thing, go in to inset into the door, like a standard door. You don't have this whole little deal on it here. Uh, but I'm gonna use it the same way that the mobile home door does. See, all the mobile home door is thinner and it uh, uses like a barrel type, like just like this without the thing on it. And it insets all the way in, just like that. So basically, push it straight in flush, just like that. It, it, it hooks up and installs just like a standard doorknob at this point. I don't, the only thing different is these things here, like I was saying. Uh, put this side in, just like that. Then, this side, just like that. See, standard standard door installation right there. Uh, the reason, like I said, the reason I'm doing this video is because the doorknob broke and I took it out and uh, nobody around here sells the standard mobile home doorknobs and that's the only difference in them right there. Uh, we found uh, that this works pretty well. All right, get both of them started. That. Like I said, the reason that I'm uh, doing this video is because we searched all day, a couple days, on like some way to mobile home doors and doorknobs and stuff like that. Like, you know, what's the 
wants a simple fix, wants a simple hack, something like that. And uh, this is what basically come up with. And uh, a lot of people don't know that you can take a standard door set and put it in a mobile home door. But I'm just doing this to show you that you can. The only difference, like I said, is the piece here. But you could also just, like I'm saying, carve that out and inset it, the piece, and I'll take it off. Uh, you can do that if you want. It's just so much simpler. All I do is take my, my pocket knife and just pop that piece off. Right. Yep, there it is. Need to adjust it a little bit. Keep it from... adjust it out and slide it to where it moves more freely but uh, other than that that's it guys right there you just take it uh, pop that piece off and you're good I mean I'll say that let me try to adjust this one out a little bit But this is definitely a cheaper way to go because the standard the, the set for a mobile home door is uh way more expensive than these. This is twelve dollars. And if you go to like a mobile home supply store and stuff like that, you're probably looking at 20, 30 bucks at least minimum for a lock set for for this. And it locks, the lock works. So and there you go. Unlock it. I still gotta adjust these doors. Uh We've been remodeling the house, but uh, I mean, there it is right there. I need to really adjust that door pretty good to set them hinges in this here. Uh, the reason I haven't done it yet is because we're putting beadboard, taking this beadboard, and we're going around about 32 inches with it around the walls like we're doing inside there. This will go all the way around, you know, all the way around here. Then I'll put a, uh, like a top rail here on it. Uh, I think it calls Wayne's coating or something like that. So, anyway, that's, that's the reason that's in here. And then I'm going to do the wood around the doors and stuff like that. I've got to trim all that out. And I'm actually going to take and inset the hinges here just a little bit more to give it just a little bit more clearance. But as of right now, I mean, it, it works. So, I need to adjust that out where it got the free, the free play in it right there. It's sticking a little bit. So, anyway. All right, guys, if you haven't done so yet, uh, hit that like and subscribe button. And anytime I come up with these little hacks or anything like this, I'll share them on our, on our channel here. Uh, if anybody has any questions or anything like that, this come from Lowe's. Uh, no, we're not sponsored by them in any way. Uh, we buy the stuff their own money. Uh, this was $12 or something for this door set. And I'm actually going to change all the doors inside the house, the, uh, the door sets. But eventually we'll be changing the doors. We'll be putting house-style doors in here and everything like that. But right now we're just trying to uh deal with what we have so anyway uh like i said if you haven't done so yet hit that subscribe button help the channel out it's free don't cost you nothing and uh like i said anytime i get little hacks like this i'll share them and uh anyway thanks you guys see you on the next one Good job. I'm watching Skype. I'm watching Skype. There you go. Good job.